none of them trading Again, yet, but finally, well, Davai getting on the uh, Shiba, his tree to tree forsaken on the other hand, he just knows where to look on. It's quite hard for them to spot him out. They just baited him though, but anyways, down at CT, where Bryce remaining. makes his presence known, but Mindfreak has a lot of things to say about that. Since they already know where he is, they can probably just converge onto him though. Bryce has a lot of problems trying to get onto him though, because it's only a classic. And they only lose Jing in the meantime much because, of course, you want to see how Moon performs in this. Though Shiba could not teleport mm. in time. The and trying to rush. That's where they're going to go for post plant here. Not enough men to defend. Coming up from the back line. Oh, here comes Javai. Oh, it's going to hit Cairo. He just wants to play around the corner, but he's just being stopped. Look how the projection coming up from PRX. What a mind game. Mind freak. Javai. And it's going to be the post plant. Bryce. Who <laughs> gets one? But it's 2v... What? Well, sorry, never mind. 4v1 is down to 1v1. I'm sorry. Christ, this is just insane. I think it's a skin skin buff for sure. It's a 6 bullet left in this vendor. He knows where Bankai is. He cannot even afford to reload. Oh. That's gonna run absolutely the timing here. Can't get the flick just in time. And he almost 1v4 is the next one. Yes, the losing streak does give the maximum 2.9. But look at how Moon taking all the damage. We're gonna push for a bit. But the Hunter Strike by Bankai did spot a couple of them. Biting into Cave of A. Oh, that shot does really troublesome. Oh no, Cairo, he actually misses my feet. That's actually big. So he needs to go and try to get one kill. And yes, he does. Davai, the total force finds one. And my Paper Rex once again is completely rolling over them. Right, last man standing again. He's the one with the half shield. But he's going up against four. Can he? Still managed to survive with an exchange of one. Ness, but he is smoked out though. And here we go. They're going into A side already. Jay's holding it down though. He is alone though. He's gonna fight a flurry of pain to make the decisions quick. They are just gonna go rush into B at this point. They don't have a choice, but the walls are up. There you go. A bit too clumsy, I have to say, but still managed to have a bit of exchange. Six more seconds. They're down to four. Now there's more talk. No more time to plan it out. It's gonna be on the side of Moon for their first ever victory. Here comes a flash coming out from Sky, hoping to scat out, getting information. Ooh, Davai. Wait, why does it say there's a technical pause? Okay, never mind, it's not. Probably a bad UI, but still they're in already for a second. Right Opening down, up okay. sight as Josh returns it up, gets up instantly, diffs Josh right there on a headshot. So there are knives gone, by the way. But please rethink and reassess what's gonna happen there. Still getting on, Bryce. Yeah, first half with like 111 or 210. I struggle to think of the comeback, but we're not discrediting them just yet because yeah. Moon chose defenders for a purpose. So when Moon goes to attack, maybe something will change. We don't really know just yet. I do want to see Cairo with wonders with an overrated. Got one, got two. Shiba did so much work with that one particular corner, taking down and deny a bit of their entry by time here. Benkai tried to take down an uh, J, but Mind Freak on the other hand. Making sure that's not gonna happen. Now it's back to where we started again. Cairo with an overrated. Didn't work out quite well. It's just. But it's not really making any fancy plays. Dante Suri comes out. Haven't seen it actually tag anyone, but yes, it does. That's Davai down already. The Suri is just some bullets though. But still, it's like two members down from Paper X. There is some hope. Where's the start though? Here we go. Let's try to do another one. Can he get it down? Shiba got his back. Mind feet. Last man standing. A sliver of hope here. Gets double peek there. So. He has to run away just in time, but he gets tagged now. A series of unfortunate events. So two members down. Once again, Jay. Without anything used, he's uh, once again down. I think he used his recon. Nothing else can be done, but that's a bit too late. Here comes Forsaken, taken down by Moon Josh. Well, we do have a headhunter coming up from Kyra down out as well. Davai, start to make a play. Oh, he never did this off, honestly speaking. Well, I'm not gonna sugarcoat this in any way. To take that advantage here. That's true. See? No Jing, might just walk out into Shiba. Thing too fancy. A mind is gonna make his way. Try to maybe try to get a flank through double doors, but since it's already planted, he could just all play for default. Post plant, Cairo taking out one, gets his double for himself. Two Jing, because they had to price those since they are completely blinded, but it doesn't matter. It's just Moon at least taking a couple of rounds. Okay, never mind, Mansfi. Gonna run into Bryce in the meantime, but the crosshair is gonna be ready. Bryce down. So since Paper X does have to buy this round already, they, uh, they can't disrespect Paper X though. Moon it needs to just now, it's just to refetch the spike to get into the site to think about where to go in now this is a bit too late you know we're talking about a might be the choose the chosen uh spike 
site for them, but coming up from Cave, this is going to be a difficult one. Look at how many eyes already PRX staged themselves, set up to a... Got himself a bit of information, there are people there just going to go in, they're just going to ram it in. This is quite a risky move coming up from Moon, they lost quite a lot of men. There goes Forsaken, taking on Double Down, and it's going to be Bankai finish to do, it's just a bit of an extra here. But Chiba and Josh managed to shut down on Forsaken and Ching, this is the moment that they've been calm ready. Look at how fast the response coming out from PRX from behind. Okay, they didn't check left, they only checked left, they only checked right. In the meantime, we have a big spike from Kyle. He is in, so my thing is down in the meantime, though they are coming by the wall, it's not fair though, Shiba makes it good, but Bankai tries to close it up for them, but it's a 1 versus 4 situation. No problem, yep. it doesn't do anything, but that's a quick entry again from Cairo, opening it up, but forcing it gets one for himself, gets the second one in the meantime, making a third, and he's not back, that's a far to Bryce, he knows there's one more up there in corner, he just needs his teammate to kind of give him some information, just needs to keep walking. Just keep running, literally, and right up there, but Shiba will... It's exactly where Bankai was, he heard the shot coming up from him. Now Bankai, he whiffed it again, Shiba might just clutch this one by him. The uh, rendezvous, trademark is... Yeah, so here we go though, I need to mention this though, remember it was Forsaken opening it up here. Shiba with the possibility to clutch this and turn this around. This could be the first upset we see here, and Jing has a lot of things to say about that. Holy damn, if Shiba would have clutched that out, I guess... Too much space for the team. Even though a bit of a slightly almost clutch in the very last minute, but still, it's gonna be one more round. A bit of a sweat. If only just a tiny over one. that ledge. And yeah. here we go, Ben Kai. Oh, he's gonna get concussed though. He can't even pick out that he needs to wait it out. But Josh is gonna run up to him, no problem. Drop a bit of a spike and retake it. And now thinking about trying to get B, but the camera kind of spot him out but didn't tag anybody yet. There it goes. Oh, Josh. A Vandal versus Operator. A different story now, huh? Well, he, uh, I think he was out from his uh, TP range. I'm not exactly sure. Yeah, he's nowhere close to his TP range, so he couldn't even TP out. But Jing, though, equalizes it immediately. Remember, Forsaken, though, he's coming from the flag. And he took out the planter, though. Right down in CT. Jing gets one for himself. Not before Bryce takes one, but it's down to a one versus two. It all looks almost but over. But Jing is really very low, considering almost like a one versus... Well, one versus one, but this is Paper Rex. You cannot <laughs> discount them in any way possible. The spike is down there, and it is over. Means market control is relinquished for Paper Rex there, but Davai couldn't even land a shot as Cairo opening up hot here, but that is a sneaky wall play up there at B, but no one is there. They made it all the way to defend the spawn, and now they're trickling towards A. That's Forsaken there with a the ghost. No shields. Oh. Seems like a Deja Vu here, possibly. Forsaken. Taken. Oh, it's going to be Moon this time. Jay taking it out. It's going to be 3v1 Bankai. He just went out and just got scared there. And a ding onto Josh. Unbelievable. But it's all down to see if he can get onto Jay's though. But it seems that he peeked out there. There's a jump peek from Shiva. Not in the sights. Okay. Forsaken just spawned him out there. He immediately takes out his ex-teammate. But the spike making his way out to his feet. Some funky walls coming out by Jing. No one's really pushing out just yet. There's no to really peek out. Wasn't even remaining. expecting that. Davai with sort of a collateral. This team. Oh no. This is 1v4 again for Bryce. Yeah, he made his footsteps. On the side of B, they try to flunk it out. There's one person in mid that's gonna be Bryce trying to be more create room for the team as well. But on the side of Paper X. Two drones still gonna catch each other. The Hunter's Fury. That's actually gonna come out though. Alright, so the return one as well with Mindfeet. In the meantime, gets one onto Shiba though. He will tag Mindfeet pretty low. He's down at 30 in the meantime. But the cross on Bankai Mindfeet. It is good. But Forsaken can get a shot there. Cairo is down in the meantime. Another two versus two. Still could be anyone's game. Mindfeet was waiting for the heal and he comes in the meantime there though. Can he land a shot through the wall? And he does it! And Cairo cuts it up for his team. That's three for him. Seeker's out. It's already out. While Cosmic Divide on Mindfeet still usable for now but definitely we'll go for the push plan later on a couple of exchange and trades being done between Benkai and Shiba but following up it's gonna be a tricky one they found him he's gone yes it's a very very good cross between pushing in mid and that's what he's gonna do for now straight into B found one going in go for the side of B main trying to find oh my goodness Nobody actually have any idea! Uh, audio cue? Don't you know how you just died there? Forsaken just walked in? In like that, you know. Oh, wait, enemy remaining. Okay. Nice. Smoke's definitely, but it's not a... And he 
definitely knows how to pick this fight occasionally. Oh, he, has... oh, he got stuck! <laughs> Oh yeah, you can move. He tried it though, ladies and gents. Here comes the cross, and he tries to do it onto him. He gets one in the meantime. It's almost an ace. He needs to check wine. He doesn't know the right last one is right there under heaven, and he needs to just see this one. He doesn't have a cloud burst. He tries to use it. He gets gravity, gravity well, well, and he just looks like he's dying here. Bryce will deny him the ace and moon. Will it be the same for this round? It's gonna be four for all. Oh, you gotta be careful though. He gets it onto Bryce in the meantime, but Shiba's there ready. We'll put a stop to him in the meantime. But Minecraft also with the trade. See, these teams, they're playing off each other's kills. Let no sacrifice go unpunished, right? Not really unpunished, but unrewarded. Here we go, another one in the meantime. Look at this pretty textbook play. But Tama oh. is not checking no. there. Cairo punished, and J also another one. Round ended fast. of Moon pushing in, but you do know Forsaken. If it's too quiet, it starts to push over. Wait, Jing just got punished to pick out a catwalk, so he's down. And mind you, those were guns, right? So one free gun for him. Forsaken gets one at least. Immediate trade off by Cairo. Cairo almost down. By to having a bit of a tough run at first, but here it comes going full all in. 30 seconds. Coming left. in with uh, the blades, but it didn't work out quite right. Hunter's Fury hitting it quite hard. Down to double. Along with so many people around the boathouse. Spot it out. Badly busted. Oh no. Blinded. Shot down. Still got a bit of an exchange. Combo giving away whoever's actually in the mid and the market. Going around the back side, all the way, a oh, long bum here. Oh. Uh, Forsaken, right. that is... Uh... Lucifer, I'm running over there as well, Cosmic Divide in between the moment they picked out. Oh my god, Benkai. Oh, there goes another one, Davai. What happened to Moon? Himself in mid, while we do have the Cosmic Divide being open, none of the mind break. There comes the rush. They're gonna go in with brute force this time. Oh, Mind Freak and the vibe. Bankai is there as well. Yep. speak. Bryce tried to shoot down the recon bot. He saw it coming miles away. So he found out Forsaken. I like this very well because like uh, the timing of the wall is pretty good as well. They wait for Forsaken to go in and then the wall just segregated the rest of the team. So punishes him out. So now in the meantime though, once again Moon in a better advantage of Cairo. But right into the fight makes good use of Cairo really on fire here. Bankai and Jing left. Coming up from the window, while being pressured. Oh, jump and gun is still going to work. What a nice way to do it. Here comes you, said they might not get a plant. They definitely already planted and going for post. It's 2v2, Cairo. Oh my goodness, he's just really on form today. Yep, that's 3k for him. That also doesn't mean that the round is over just yet. It is Jing after all, it's planted for hell and Cairo, never mind. Almost an ace. No. Right. Like to make wonders here. Eh? Shiba tried to block, oh, a bit too late, Forsaken. Already bridge in, another wall here. Eh? Double wall inside of Garden. Yep, a very offensive wall, that off angle. Caught and off guard, we are playing the crossroads here for sure. The... That's... Where's the chocolate landing? I'm I actually don't curious. know, it ended up in heaven. Okay, yeah, it's not connecting. This is a successful post plan for Paper X, and they are jetting out of there. Gonna run into a couple. That's Moon, by the way, making it work somehow. <laughs> and killing Paper Bank guy. Got himself first. Uh, oh, oh, was that? No, too late. Why did he swap over the short dot? Definitely, they are pushing both of them a double peak at the same time. Back towards Jing. They rush and they got into the site. And three site has been done. Going for post plan here yeah. now. It's going to be 3v2. Bryce, but we got Bryce and Shiba. This is for you to step up your game as well. Bryce has done so many. And it's down to Shiba to, yeah. to just use a bit of an ice wall to uh, abuse it a bit more. Here. Mind freak with Max Shields plus Spectre. Trying to get on site is probably a tall task already. In the meantime, though, exit frags look pretty good here, but Jing himself, never mind. Shiva has some good shots. Shiva with a double already. Suddenly, it's just Shiva and Bryce against my feet. They know it's not there. My feet takes up Bryce to the meet. I'm gonna get the run into Shiva. They both have guns, but they need to try to make this work, and they cannot. 
Move. Not the buy, but they have the buys. But for second, right, it's dead. It's nice. Are uh, gone. So for second, he's coming against some right clicks on his head. But Bryce is the one that gets two. Not before the little pixel shot by Jake. Whoa, little, okay. He has the oh, he was gonna bring back Bankai on the fourth stream, but the scan. It is good, guys. Takes out Jing. Now Mindfree and Bankai left alive. The spike needs to be taken out away. But Josh will pop the ult as well. The Seekers are going to look for them. They no one is up at Defender spawn. But holy damn. I think the kills oh, are pretty no. much isolated. Yep, one of those crawly flowers are up the way into top mid area. Mind Freak. Try to do the big wrap around here. Okay, that he was ready for Mind Freak. No problem. But that's Bankai. He's got recon. He's got no shield. He is about uh -huh. to get scanned out and double peeked by Moon. Want to enter in. Got himself already in. Now all they need to do is go for blood. They shush away. Josh down. Down to two person. Shiba and also Bryce who got himself the Cosmic Divide. But do he really want to use it now? I don't think he actually can. It won't be worth it to use it. I mean, the scan was just unfortunate because he caught Jage down on site. He gets mowed down too. Look oh, at that crouching. Out. He just whiffed it as well. If he goes down oh. on locks, he's going to get in trouble. But Mindfreak will... There you go, Jage is ready in and he's about to get stunned. And mind you, he's going to get scanned as well. <laughs> it's the Odin. Got no value. Cairo gets one before being taken out. Three versus four. The you Cosmic Device out means... Okay, other. that is just... That's just doomed right now for Moon. Well, it rhymes after meantime. Moon the Odin's two. was too heavy for him to lift over on the others. To oh, lift yeah. it up is too heavy. But here comes Shiba throwing out everything that he has, but a bit too late. Jing, finish off! Triple on Jing! This is gonna be the Sentinel play as the duelist. Still five men, well and alive. He even revived one of his mates versus one Josh. Now, Josh, what you gonna do? He got one, but till the moon has finally run out of steam. We thought that uh, thought they were, they were climbing up pretty good. Then Paper Rice called the timeout, gathered their thoughts, gathered their wits, and said, "That's enough from Moon." Well, we do have Benka getting a spike. There goes the judge taking on one forsaken dash. Oh no, Bryce just gonna judge him down. They start to make the forced entry, but it didn't work out quite right for the side of PRX. Now, there are only one more match point to go, but this might be they're them digging their own grave here by forcing it way too much and way too soon. Yeah, here we go. Bryce kind of in an awkward situation for the judge out that distance, but Jage, he is now there. There's three people down all of a sudden from Moon. Make that three versus two, though. Hunter's Fury will tag one, but the spikes all the way up at A. The rest of the team trying to make a B line. Funny B line to A. Sorry, make an A line there. And my face already so low. He's gonna play retake. Right here. Here we go. Shiba, they're isolated. He's down already. And Jing up.